This video is to illustrate the main components on the air conditioning system. We are talking about the original system found on the old SCs here that used an R12 Freon. The R12 Freon is illegal and can't be sourced anywhere, so if you want to convert your system over to R134, you can do so, but it will lose some effectiveness. The workhorse of the system is the compressor. The white arrow points to the high port side of the compressor. This line comes out of the compressor and goes to the condenser, which is located on the inside of the engine grill. The low part of the system is located directly beneath. The valve for testing the pressure in the system is covered with a small black cap that needs to be removed. The receiver dryer is commonly located in the inside rear of the front left fender. There should be a small cap covering the sight glass, which contains a small white ball. This ball helps to tell whether or not your system is full. When adding refrigerant to the system, simply check the level of the ball. When the ball rises to the top of the glass, you should have more than enough fluid in your system. The AC blower motor is located in the front trunk and is an important part of the system. The blower motor helps the front condenser cool the refrigerant in the system by blowing air over it. Check the proper operation of the motor when the system is running and replace it as necessary. Thanks for watching. Be sure to subscribe to our channel and check out another video in this series.